You know what time it is. It is what it is. Your boy Musa back at it again though. Today's video reaction is on Pop the Balloon or Find Love. So everybody check it out. Hopefully this video is dope, man. But anyway, if you guys enjoyed this video reaction, take a few seconds, subscribe, comment, like, and share. Click the notification bell and join the family. Also welcome to your love, your support. Let's get it. Hello, welcome in. I'll have you take that. God What's damn, that early? Jesus. My name is Chandler. Chandler? Yes. Okay, and Chandler, how old are you? 28. 28, and what do you do? You know what, 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 like, he didn't even get there and they're already popping. They just looked at him and they already made their decision. You know what I'm saying? This is why I would say when women always say, oh, it's about the personality, whether he's funny. I would say that's cap. That's later. How is it, could it be somebody personality if you ain't not physically attracted to me? They, they'd be like, it's not about the physical, it's more of the character. Girl, please, man. Y'all know it's about the physical attraction. Y'all know whether he's wearing Jordan, whether he's wearing some Louis Vuitton Gucci. I mean, so on and so forth. You know what I'm saying? There's like different, high, you know, different type of standard, you know, female look for. You know what I'm saying? But mainly, it's physical appearance. You know what I'm saying? And I bet you they're all going to say his physical appearance. You. I'm a um, fraud analyst. Oh, that's so dope. I just look at customers' accounts, make sure that they're... Um, what? Fraudulent use of uh, their account. Just because he's a fraud analyst? Come on, guys. Bro, that's, to me, that seemed like an interesting career. Account number, just pay him back if it's a, a fraud case. If not, I just deny the claim off the evidence I found. Okay, okay. pretty cool. Yeah. And now, what are some things you look for in a woman? Yeah, um, just uh, kind of like my other half. You know what I mean? Mm. Someone that compliments me, okay. someone that's a... Uh, Damn. You know, by my side, definitely uh, loves me for just me, you okay, know? Okay, that's yeah. nice. Yeah. <laughs> now, what okay. are some of your deal breakers? Uh, definitely, like, kids with multiple men. Mm. Um, and that's just, a good one. Uh, close-mindedness, you know, okay. not willing to just try new things and, you know, okay. just be spontaneous. Okay, yeah. all right. Now, this one I'm talking about, to me, it sounds like a down-to-earth dude. Very open-minded. You feel me? Not too picky. You get what I'm saying? You know what he wants. You feel me? He's in a nice career field. You know, he definitely makes some money and all that. So, I know the reason why they popping like that. Because that's a nice dude right here. You get what I'm saying? I don't know, man. I think women are more confused than niggas. <laughs> and that's a fact, man. So, we did get a couple of pop balloons. Of course. Let's go over to just a few of these ladies, see why they ended up popping their balloons. Sure, I bet you I might not here. even like the response, bro. <laughs> we can have your name and age and why you ended up popping. My name's Kayla. I'm 23. Hi. Um, I just popped it just because I don't like your outfit. Sure. I like what? your face. I like your height. I like everything about you. Like, if you had something different, I would definitely like. That's cap. You talking about you don't like the outfits, but you like his face? Girl, please, you do know you could change the outfit. He just don't have one single outfit in the closet, right? You do not know he could change it. That's Cap, bro. She, she bullseye. You like pick me. So, but, yeah. My next question for you is what, what kind of outfit would you expect me to like wear? That's, what, that's what, a good response. Not a flannel because it's hot as shit outside. Definitely, and then, definitely, um, definitely, definitely. Other than that, maybe if you would have just took, oh, anime. Not that either. Mm. Pokemon so that's, or that's Cap. She didn't even know what outfit he should wear. He was like, come on. She's capping. She's capping hard, bro. Breaker? Uh, no, I don't know. It's just childish. But if you would have probably should have off, maybe. Sure. It would have gave. Childish? What? Girl, you playing. You tripping. I bet you some of the niggas that you mess with play video games and watch anime. At this point. Every man, women, or child out there watch anime. Some form of anime. That's cap. It's embedded in our culture. You get what I'm saying? That is cap. Bro, this girl's capping hard, bro. You disrespect me. You get what I'm saying? Save a little bit more, but you making me hot standing in front of me. Sure, so, yeah. Sure, sure, sure. <laughs> She's, but that's it. No worries. And then Chandler. Yeah. It's so like interesting. Yeah. But yeah, that's it. You don't even no like worries. the name? I would have. Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. Now she's capping hard, bro. Time. She's capping. Yeah, actually. Yeah, I like the braids. Um, very beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, tattoos are cool. Thank you. She's definitely someone I would approach. Okay. Yeah. All right, cool. Let's go over to another lady. Sure. Going to stick around. I and like her response, bro. Name and age and why you ended up popping. I'm Lex. I'm 23. Lex. And you're just not my type. 
No worries. Okay, like, that's straight. The whole aesthetic is just not. Okay. It doesn't fit me. Sure. Okay. No so, worries. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Okay. That's cool. Okay. All right. And now is Lex someone that you would approach? Yeah, no, she's beautiful. Yeah. Thank you. Love the hairstyle, love the dress. Tattoos are cool. Yeah, yeah everything's cool. Yeah, Thank she's you. cool. Yeah. Yo, he's too cool. nice, Thank bro. You, Lex. He's and too we nice. I'm down here as yes. well. Let's yes. go. Listen, here. man. <laughs> Listen. There's time to be nice and that there's time to not, bro. I don't want to say it. He's beautiful. Girl, please, man. Girl, please. I'm not going to say that. Because my feelings hurt. <laughs> I'm just saying, like, you know what? It's cool. You feel me? Be the big man and all that. You know what I'm saying? But damn, that's just like, girl don't even like his anime shirt, bro. What you got against anime? If we can have your name and age and why you ended up popping. Hi, um, my name is Jira. I'm 22 years old. Probably the age. outfit too. And um, I just popped because, um, even though I, do, I don't really know you, but um, based off of physical attraction, I'm not necessarily attracted. Totally. But that's really it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, I respect okay. I freckles. Well, thank thank you. freckles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, you're like really it. handsome. Thank you. Sure. I appreciate that. Yeah, sure. Thank you. Girl, uh, stop. Is she also someone that you would approach? Why is these girls capping so hard, bro? I'm not physically, I don't know why I popped the balloon, right? You don't know because everybody pop, you pop. She's more of like a follower. Everybody pop, she pop, she had no good reason. And then she said, I'm not physically attracted to you, right? But the freckles is cute and you handsome. How can I be handsome, but at the same time, you're not attracted to me? That means that you don't find nothing good looking about me to be attracted to. If you say I'm handsome, that means you find me, uh, uh, you find some form of attraction with me in order to say I'm handsome. Like she capping, bro. She's a follower. She followed the rest of them because everybody was popping. None of them had a good reason why they popped that damn balloon. Oh, yeah, definitely. Mm. Eyes are beautiful. Hair Thank is you. great. Dress is great. Y'all boy too yeah, nice, bro. You too okay. nice, bro. Okay. Let's go over here. If yes. we can have your name and age and why you ended up popping. Um, I'm Jazz. I'm the 26. Outfit. Um, I pop really because I feel like we would be more friends. Um, I'm a very like not aggressive, but I'm a very dominant person, and I just can't see you being overly dominant over me. So I just feel like okay. we'd be better as friends. Interesting. Interesting. Okay, so you feel that I would not be the dominant one. I just feel like situation. you'd be passive, and I don't. Not like there's nothing wrong with that. That's yeah. just you know I just feel which is fine if you're passive, just yeah. not for me. Interesting. Okay. No worries. Uh, I, but I you're feel. cool. Like not, not, yeah, nothing. Yeah. No, no. I totally understand. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. All right. And now is Jasmine someone that's your type? Yeah, she's beautiful. Love the braids. Love the outfit. Everything's cool. You know what I'm saying? Real stylish. She's cool. Yeah. Definitely. Thank definitely. Thank you. Someone <laughs> like the outfit. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Let's go on over here. Yeah. Yes. We can have your name. One thing I will say, I'll be the wrong person for the show because, bro. <laughs> I will bring fire. Man, bro, I ain't going to do that. But I'm just saying, I might be the wrong person for this show, bro. Because, nah, man. You get what I'm saying? Nah. He's too nice. Now, I get why people were saying, like, he's small for, like, a sim type of, like, you feel me? I don't say he's a sim. I just think he's too much of a nice dude, bro. Even age Even a respond, bro. I'm Brianna. I'm 26. It's the fit. <sighs> You know, my typical, <laughs> my typical physical attraction is like. Okay, she like bad, bad boy. She look like, she like hood niggas. She probably like a nigga wearing, you know, Gucci, Dior and all type of shit. You know what I'm saying? Probably a little muscular with tattoos. You know what I'm saying? That's what she probably like. You know what I'm saying? But why the hell you had to take that deep? <sighs> like, come on, bro. Like, if you want to let a brother down, let it easy. Stop making too over dramatic. Like, damn. I like got dark skin, so. Totally. You know, you pretty light. You light bright. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> You're not ugly, though. Yeah. Now, I've, uh, I've, I've kind of, like, seen this before, and I've just mm -hmm. always wanted to ask, what, what is, like, your negative or what is your sort of, like, issue? Not necessarily issue, but what is your, like, I guess for a lack of better words, what is your beef, if you will, with light skin individuals? Do you I don't necessarily have a beef at all? Yeah, yeah. You just I'm just more so attracted to dark skin. Like, dark skin. That's exactly. just 
you know, chocolate. Ooh. Okay. You feel me? It make you melt. Okay. So that's just it. Um, she ain't need to do all that. Not, she ain't need all that. Yeah. Like, stop. But stop with a cap. Yeah. Just a little bit darker. Chocolate, if I was, yeah. dark skin. Mm. Okay. For sure. For sure. I, it compliments me. You know? Interesting. It compliments okay. my skin tone. Okay. Yeah, but you that. light too. That. What are you talking okay. about? I don't have a B. <laughs> I like that. I like that. Reasonable answer. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Definitely. <laughs> and that was uh, Brianna, someone that's your type? Yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah. Beautiful. Love the earrings. Love the hair. Dress is awesome. Heels are great. Everything looks cool. It. Yeah. No, you're great. Okay. All right. Thank you. Two more ladies up here. Of course. We can have your name and age and why you ended up popping. My name is Jacqueline. I'm 25. Jacqueline. Hello. I ended up popping because I feel like we're not aesthetically compatible. Sure. Like, I'm not really filling your shirt sure. or like the rips in your pants sure but i no think worries. you are very handsome in the no face worries. now is it like a past experience you've had with guys that dress like me or is it just like mm, not really feeling the style no not a past experience i'm just not feeling the style of course of course mm. i appreciate that thank you You're okay. welcome <laughs> and now same thing is she someone that is she yeah, beautiful type? beautiful love the hair earrings look great dress is cool you know what i'm saying accessorizing well heels look cool yeah everything's cool yeah thank i like you. it i like it <laughs> thank you. you're right. welcome okay at your name age and why you ended up popping hi i'm esther i esther. am 23 23 cool i have some reasons god damn bro i feel for the brother bro this is a lot of no's bro I, to me probably the third the third or the fourth i already given up bro and this might be like, I'll just take the exit door. It's just too much. Like, the response, to be honest with you, like, at least the honest about it, but it just seems like a lot of cap. Because if you're talking about the outfit, right, the outfit could be changed. You know what I'm saying? The outfit could be changed. Just a style. You know what I'm saying? It's a clothes. The clothes don't make the man. The man make the clothes. You know what I'm saying? So you can't say, oh, because the outfit, I can't, I can't talk to you. Like, I don't know, I bet you some of y'all niggas out there have dated a girl or messed with a chick. Well, you hated the outfit. You even hated the the weave, the blonde weave on their head. That looked like a... a <laughs> you feel me? I don't even like that. But dudes would still talk to you and still give you that chance. You know what I'm saying? Because they know what you want doesn't make you. They trying to look for the person we need. So I feel like this is cap, bro. You acting like the nigga can't change his clothes. Like he got one set of clothes. Hey, I don't know. The same type of outfit, bro. It's for you. You yeah, ready for him? Okay, yeah. so I like that you find beauty in everyone. Yeah. All the ladies here are gorgeous. I appreciate that. Definitely. But I feel like you should know exactly what you want. Oh, I do. Trust me. Okay. All right. No, that's locked good. in. Trust me. I All already right. know. Because she did ask, like, is she your type? And you kept saying yes and yes and yes. And there's nothing wrong with that. No, I love chocolate. You know what I'm saying? Okay, There's a bunch what? of beautiful black women here. I'll take so. it back then. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Trust me. Second reason, if I could just take the shoes, I'll take the shoes, right? Mm -hmm. And then just strip all of that. Keep the face. You're handsome. Wait, so you don't like the sneakers? No, I like the sneakers. Okay. But this, gone. Oh, okay. So the rest <laughs> the of outfit, the, the clothes. It, the outfit. Okay. Which, honestly, it's something that you can change. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Well. Yeah, of course. Yeah. But it's just like, you know, you kind of knew what we were going to look like okay so this like is my next goes. question this yes. is my next question because i've seen a few of these videos okay. and a lot of women have like straight up flamed men off like wearing suits off wearing like what they're comfortable with I so you that. tell me like what what do you want your man to like how do you want your man to dress how do you want your man to look would you dress like this on the first date with me yes this is what i'm comfortable with okay. this is who i am Hey, I love that. I respect yeah. that. Oh, damn. Yo, I don't know what y'all said, man. This nigga. <laughs> yo, listen, man. He spoke. That's who he is. Like, I'm not going to switch that just because, like, you, you don't feel. It's the same thing. Like, I would say I don't like your outfit. You know what I'm saying? You feel me? Like, that outfit is not even an outfit. Like, you acting like it's an outfit for the club, man. It's an outfit like. I, man, I ain't, I ain't trying to offend nobody, but you know what I mean, bro. You get what I'm saying? Like, you know what I mean? Like, I would not want my girls to be dressed like that, to be honest with you. It's too much. You get what I'm saying? You tell me we go on a date and you weren't that, man, that... You, you saying his outfit make you hot, bro? That leather dress y'all got on, I don't know what it is, but that shit makes me hot, too. Because I know you got to be sweating there because that attract heat. You know what I'm saying? But... Listen, man, I respect the brother, man. At least he's stand on all 10 toes, bro. He's stand on all 10 toes. You get what I'm saying? He's stand on business, bro. But like I said, all all their responses cap. 
to be honest with you, but we're going to take it with a grain of salt. You know what I'm saying? If, like, you you dress like that on the first date, I would probably walk out. So then my next question is, how do you want your man to dress on the first date? Bring back that dark skin man that <laughs> so outfit. Do with the with the open. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. My brother. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Well, your brother can yeah, yeah. learn a few things. Got it. For but sure. yeah. Okay. Other than that, I mean, you're handsome. Your answers have been great. Your questions have been great. I like your face. Like I said, it's just the outfit. Nah, she capping. I think you know what it is. What it, the way she was trying to do. What she was trying to do was trying to school the brother. You get what I'm saying? Kind of. I'm not gonna say he was trying to. She was trying to disrespect me anyway, but I feel like she was trying to throw some shades out of you, bro. You know what I'm saying? I think that's what she was trying to do. But I like his response. He respond as a man should. You know what I'm saying? Don't be disrespectful. But you got to school these bros, man. Besides that, maybe. Who knows? Because <laughs> one, one, one point I also want to make is when he hear me ask him, well, how do you want your man to dress? He asked a couple of them ladies. They didn't even know how they want their man to dress. They didn't have a response. They just go, not like that. But what if I wear something different? You might not like that either. Because, Clay, you don't even know what you want. You would say not the fit, but you don't know what kind of fit. Like, he's supposed to be wearing. You know what I'm saying? So, I think it's cat, bro. I, I, I just think, like, they look for a thug, bro. You know what I'm saying? Got gotcha. yeah. okay. Thank you. Yeah, Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. And now, is she someone that is your type? Yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love beautiful black women. You know what I mean? Dress is fantastic. Everything's on point. So I have no problem with it. So yeah, she's great. I think she was Thank trying you. to offend him. I think it was Did trying to get some type here? of response. Yeah. But... <laughs> Hello. Hi. If we can That's have nice. your name and age and why you ended up popping. Hi, I'm Karma. I'm 24. Karma. Um, actually, you are my type, and you're somebody I'll be interested in. Yes. Now, when you said that you would wear that for a first date, I'm not opposed, but I do feel like people should dress up for first dates. Okay. You know, women, we got to do a little bit more. I feel like the man should be able to subside. Okay. Now, for me, it is personally, like, I had questions, but, like, yeah. I just felt like if I wasn't going to personally go on a date with you or match further, that's stuff that we can still talk about as friends, but it just wouldn't be somebody that I would look for as a partner with you right now. Sure, sure. But otherwise, you're a great person. You seem cool. Thanks. You seem interesting. Yeah, you yeah. got some cool Respect stuff on. Respect the answer. Nice, nice. That was well-spoken. Yeah, okay. thank you. Yeah. Thank you. All right, and I feel like I know the answer I to like, this, I like that, too. Is she your type? Man, chocolate. You already know. Yeah, <laughs> come on now. Like, come on now. Dress is cool. Like, everything's good. Hair's on point. Yeah, yeah. I like the little, like, Nose ring kind of thing, yeah. It's different, yeah. Thank I like you, that. thank like you. That. Yeah, no, I found them interesting. I probably just need to know you more, but otherwise, um, I just felt like I was going more off the outfit and mm -hmm. off of just seeing my. She said, "I just need to know you a little bit more." How you gonna know the brother if you ain't went on a date? That's how you get to know people. You meet them, you go on a date, and you get to know each other. Then you make your decision from there. You say, "Well, I can't, I can't mess with you because I just gotta know you a little bit more." What? Yo, I, I don't know, man. Uh, to me, I see the more the more I'm watching this, I'm realizing this ain't a show for me because I honestly don't like the response they're giving right now because it, it doesn't sound like, I don't know, bro. Myself with you, but yeah, you seem like a great person though. Totally, totally. Cool. Thank you. Right. Thank you, sir. Thank you. So we do have an unpopped balloon here. Yeah, definitely, definitely. If we can have your name and age. Hi, my name is Mishnah. I'm 23. Okay. And Mishnah, okay. why do you still have your okay. balloon unpopped? Well, with all of my fellow colleagues, they had a lot of good points, mm. but I feel like when it comes to your outfit, you could always change your clothes. Yeah. And, mm -hmm. and I feel like Facts. when she was talking about anime, I'm a big anime nerd. Mm. Perfect. And she was saying, oh, anime is childish. So I'm like, that's what I'm looking for. That's, that's what I'm looking for. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes. But I did. Yeah. I just felt like you seem like a really cool individual. You seem Thank really you. Laid, laid back and yeah. the way you were, um, responding to the other ladies answers it wasn't defensive it wasn't yeah. like well I'm, i know i'm good looking yeah. like but you seem to very nice yeah, yeah, yeah. you seem very nice thank you i like her thank you. i like and her bro nice thank you oh there thank you go okay. there you so go let just, let's let's walk on there you go yo it's somebody always there for everybody you know what i'm saying you feel me you might go through the 20 chicks and none of them could be the right person for you but it's always that one that you eventually will meet you know what i'm saying like I said, man, it's about character. When women say, oh, I'm looking for a nice guy with character, bro, you not because the moment I meet you and I'm not to the vision of what you're looking for, you're automatically judging me. 
you don't automatically stop putting a stop. You know what I'm saying? Not even get a chance to know me. Like the other young lady on the far right said, oh, maybe I would have liked you if I got to know you more. How are you going to get to know me if we ain't talk? If we ain't want a date for you, for me to be comfortable around you, for you to be comfortable around me so we could share person, we could exchange personal conversation. We can't do that if you automatically put in a stop right there. That's why I say all of them are cat beside the one in the blue blue top, man. Right? Up here, yeah. come on up, come yeah, on. Yeah, I'm up. with that. I'm with that. I'm with that. I'm with that. <laughs> I like yes, that. I like yes, that. She okay, seemed laid back, respectful, and all that, man. One of you before we move forward. What is your type for the entire row? I just wanted. Do you have a type, or is I, everyone your type? No, you really? definitely not everyone. Okay. Um, you know, I grew up in a like predominantly like my my father and my mother, and they are both just black. Mm -hmm. So, just beautiful black woman. You know what I mean? Like someone that just loves me for me. You know, like I want to like keep mm -hmm. the the bloodline just like good. You know what I mean? Like strong. Exactly. <laughs> like black is black. You know what mm -hmm. I mean? And. Yeah, it's just as really as simple as that. Like I've just seen good, beautiful black love, and that's what I want. It's just as you should. beautiful black as you love. Should. You know what I mean? Where would you take someone on your like? Not you, someone you. Sorry, you. You're you. Right. Sorry, you're right. I'm yeah, sorry. You. I apologize. Yeah, where are we going on our first day? Yeah, yes. yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So I'm like big on like I kind of like um like for a first date I'm really big on like the picnic kind of setup. I know it's a little hot for that, but we can do like an afternoon to the like to the sunset kind of mm -hmm. like picnic mm -hmm. date. Tell you tell feel me? me? Yep, yep, you yep. know what I'm saying? With just like the the sandwiches, the 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 grapes, the water, the the blanket. You feel me? Just enjoying the scenery, enjoying each other's out. company. Just, just strawberries. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So nah, they not looking for that. They looking for a five star with a glass of wine, with some lamb chop. With some lobster, some crab meat. Said they could post on their social media saying, you know, I got this brother to spend five thousand dollars on me. You know what I'm saying? That's all they want because you could go, you could clearly tell, man. The first thing they pull in is your your face and your body ain't gonna be in her Instagram. Is the food, the the drink, and her showing the lifestyle she living that's what's gonna be you know what i'm saying so that whole picnic thing for them you feel me i don't even think that whole arcade thing is the thing it's the more of like the fancy vibe i mean come on man they dress up to to be going to those locations come on what you say man they ain't dress up for no picnic you know what i'm saying but it is what it is Jeez. like i'm just a lover boy at the end of the day so definitely that's what's up that's what's up you can have it thank you oh thank you. That's okay, what's up. Okay, I like this. I like this, man. Final question. Like so is it a yes for you for him? It's a yes. I of like course. Him. Yes, but is it a yes for you for her? Definitely. We got a match. <laughs> okay, I'll take this mic. And y'all can go on up. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, if you guys enjoyed this video, you guys can take a few seconds to subscribe, comment, like, and share, click the notification bell, and join the family. Always welcome. Sure loves your support. Okay, let's go ahead and bring out our next single guy. Oh, snap. Me and him, Sean. Hello, welcome. <laughs> oh, oh snap. All right, if we can have your name. Uh, my name is Aaron. Aaron, how old yes, are you? Yeah, I'm 29. 29, okay. Yes. And what do you do? Uh, I'm a licensed plumber. Oh, okay. very cool. Yeah. And now, what do you look for in a woman? Um, I look like I look for a woman that's not promiscuous, and um, has a career going for herself. Okay. Yes, ma'am. And now, what are some of your deal breakers? So, okay, this one, like, I've been waiting to check out because this is the dude right here. Supposedly, he lost his job. Right, he got five for. His response to this show, they got him flying and all that stuff. Um, you feel me? And you know, it's a whole bunch of uh, he's taking a lot of heat right now. You could say a lot of L's, whatnot. It is what it is, but we're gonna see, man. What's the reason why? Because I've been wanting to check this out, but I'm glad you guys recommended this. You feel me? Uh, deal breaker being promiscuous, <laughs> not cleanly, um, don't have a career, nothing really going for yourself. Okay. All right, so we did get a pop balloon. Let's okay. go ahead and go on over there and see what's going on. Yes. 
All right, if we can have your name and age and why you popped your balloon. <laughs> and I was just saying why niggas is like, yo, this brother like <laughs> like a turn. <laughs> Hi, I don't my know, name bro. is Karma. I'm 24. Okay. Oh, sorry. I'm supposed to say the pop in the balloon property. <laughs> Got you. Um, for me, it just did not work. I didn't feel like I had chemistry or I wasn't fully attracted to you. And I feel like that counts if we are going to be going through a dating show, you know? Yes, the feeling is definitely mutual. So, uh, God damn, say. bro. Thank you. You did me a favor. You know, oh, my so God. You Jesus. Like? Jesus, brother. That is, Damn, that's too much, my nigga. Yo, yo, your brother was straight on attack, bro. He was on that attack mode, man. Thank yeah. you, Queen. You too. Okay. Jesus. Well, I ahead. felt that. All right. We got to pop over here. Oh, snap. If we can have your <laughs> name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. Hi, my name is Tara. I'm 22. Okay. And why did we end up popping our balloon? Um, the comment you made uh, didn't really. I like a more humble person. Mm. That's the one that responds so defensive-ish. Yeah. That's really it. I, yeah. I didn't really necessarily like that's how you responded. That's fine. Hey, I could just, yeah. all I can do is be honest, I you mean, know? I yeah, be honest. I be came authentic over here self. To, that's okay. To, to, to find a match sure. that wasn't matching. Sure. That's I all, Queen. I 100% understand. Yes, yeah. yeah. Sure. Okay. And I was, um, she someone that's your type? Um, she all right, you know? Mm -hmm. You're not really my type. I don't mean to be disrespectful. No disrespect. You know, but if I seen you in public, I wouldn't reach out totally to Totally fine. Yes, ma'am. Oh, you. my God. <laughs> I'm to get a pop balloon up here, your name. I ain't gonna lie, the more this nigga talk, the more he's losing interest of the ladies, bro. I, I mean, if I were him at that point, I'd just be quiet. <laughs> I'd just be quiet, because I guess the first time when he got laid, they all were feeling, but after he started talking, bro, nah, all hell break loose, man. I'm an agent why you ended up popping your balloon. I'm Lex, and I'm 23, and I pop my balloon because I feel like you could be a tad bit disrespectful. Like How? How you, like, I don't know, arrogant a little bit. Yes. Yeah, just that. Well, voice in my opinion is not arrogant, you know. She asked me if she would be a good fit for me. If I like what I see, you know, uh, it's contrary to the truth. So of course. that's all I can do is just state what I see. I don't. That's not a good look for me. That's all, Queen. But, uh, like, how is this disrespectful? It's like, if you honest, it's disrespectful. Come on. The brother's just staying his opinion. It's the same thing y'all told the last guy. He ain't your type because of that fit and all that stuff. That dude could have said y'all being disrespectful. You feel me? But he's saying y'all know his type. Now he's being disrespectful. I don't get this, bro. Uh, thank you. You did me a favor as well. Yeah. Also, oh, um, shit. <laughs> what I have to say is, it's not what you say. This is what I mean by what I said. It's not what you say, it's how you say it. Yes. You could have rephrased a lot of the things that you have been saying to me as well as the other girls differently. But that's all I have to say. But you talking about rephrase it? Bro, the brother is just speaking his truth. He responding the way he wants to respond. It's the same way as y'all basically... Went hard on the other dude talking about his fit. He's wearing anime shirt. Y'all didn't rephrase that. Y'all said how y'all felt. That's all it is, bro. But one thing about me is I'm not going to change who I am. Of course. To fit somebody else's liking. You know, I'm just going to tell it how it is. If you're not it, that's not it. You know, cool. the one that is it, I'm going to let it be known. Okay. You know, for surely, yes. Respectful. Okay. All right. Your name and age and why you ended up popping your balloon. Brianna, 26. My eyes are, are up here, baby. Are you looking at the tattoos? No, I, I'm, I'm looking at the hair on your arms. You know, women I deal with, they don't have hair on their arms. Do <laughs> <laughs> Yo, she was trying to throw some shades, bro. She was trying to throw some shit like that, like, yo, you, you, you kind of say, you trying to throw a homeboy out. Homeboy said, nah, I'm just looking at home because you got hair. You see how she put her hair on her hand? Boy. <laughs> yo, these girls are funny, but this dude's different, bro. Too much. Hey, I'm just being honest, Don't do queen. too much. You know, I, I don't like that. That's okay. all I was looking at. You trying to. Now, nah, because, yeah, listen, man. I'm glad he called her out because the last guy, she was being very dramatic. I was like, Ugh. I'm like, what? Like, you get what I'm saying? Right now, she was trying to, I feel like she clout chasing. You feel me? I feel like she was about to feel like she about to throw some hard line, defending. Like, you get what I'm saying? I don't think, I think he's just saying, listen, I'm not feeling you. It is what it is. Let's say if I'm looking at 
particular body you just parts, wasn't but looking that's at my not eyes. what it is. That's no, I was looking I was at the hair on your Anyways, arms, Anyways, she asked me the question. Yes. Um, yeah, I'm in heels and you ain't tall enough. Okay. Don't do too much, Well, though. you're not qualified, baby. All right, that's so that's cool. all good. Let's move on. Let's move on. Yo, yeah, she's like, so we, ah! do, we do still have three unpop, but she looking like. They about to pop. The pop? Okay. They about to pop, bruh. Okay. All right. If we can have your name and age and why you ended up popping. My name is Jacqueline. I'm 25. I popped because I have hair on my arms. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Just because you got hair on your arms, that's okay, though, Queen. You look phenomenal, though. Thank you. You know, she ain't Don't fit to my liking. She ain't even fit to my... Hey, excuse me, Queen. I'm, I'm talking to this woman. Oh, my. <laughs> I like her. At least she, she find humor in this, bro. For real. Right here. Oh, well, I could look. But one thing I'm going to say is, like, this is a dating show I would never even go on. Just for the fact that it's just like, I think... Whatever you do, whatever you say is just going to be looked front upon. You know what I'm saying? Because like he said, people want you to respond the same way that fit their narrative. You know, like, you can't be you. You know what I'm saying? You can't be honest. You know, be yourself. It's like, you know, you go on this show, you won't have to talk a certain way. Try to, like, sugarcoat your words. That's nobody be offended. I think you're not being real. I'm a real nigga. I like being real. So this was not be something for me. Cause I would like to be honest. He's was being honest, and he's just kind of like, I don't know. He's taking heat for that, man. Look anyway. I could look anyway. I could look any way I want to. Yes, I. Okay. You know. Okay. I, but yeah, can y'all give her her balloon back though? She don't want it. Yeah. Do you want your balloon back, Queen? Uh, we're not talking to you, sweetheart. <laughs> okay. You, you already been. I already let you know. I'm not interested in. Damn. They. <laughs> Oh my God, it's crazy, man. Got more hair on your arms than me, baby. But uh, anyways. Okay, so he's saying get your balloon back, but how are you feeling, him? Um, I'm not gonna get my balloon back. Okay. okay. <laughs> All right, no problem. So we do still have uh, two balloons. Yes. Do we still have two balloons? No. <laughs> okay, let's go over here. I saw you hesitate, that's why I had to ask. So if we can have your name and age and why you ended up popping. My name is Kayla, I'm 23. Um, originally, I was not gonna pop my balloon because I know a lot of them popped it because he was being, I guess, arrogant. Mm -hmm. But to me, I like my man that's not gonna sit in every girl's face and you know, complimenting them, you know? Mm -hmm. So I didn't find that offensive to me, but when they started, that what was going on, I'm very like, I'm, I don't wanna say I'm argumentative, but I don't want my man to argue back with me because then I feel like it's gonna always be a problem. That was the only reason why I popped my balloon because I was just like, dang. Um, but then with me, you kind of got a little bit catty with me. You a little sassy just a little bit. And since you wanna come at everybody over here, I'm gonna get at you too. You kind of look like a Ninja Turtle. You're not that cute. You, you need to relax. Uh, you stocky uh -huh. as hell. And I was trying to be okay. respectful, but okay. yeah. like you was you was really coming up like I didn't I didn't like it. I'm from the south and I can okay. handle like a lot of She's somebody who don't like to mind her own business. I feel like she like to stand for other people. Even if it's not about her, she would like to jump in. That'd be somebody I would not really want to mess with. <laughs> just in generally, just because she's gonna just bring a fight and I would have to get involved. And you know, which case I'll end up getting in trouble and type that's the type of chick I will not mess with, to be honest with you. I get it, but I think like this is a dating show, you should look out for yourself and you choose what you like. But I d I don't think it's her business to come in and trying to stand up for everybody or speak on behalf of everybody, because I mean, I don't know, man. I, I I didn't like that. Before I liked her, just for the fact is she know what she likes and whatnot. But the whole thing, like trying to feel like she's trying to stand for these women and all that. Nah, man, just stand for yourself. If you don't like him, you don't like him. But don't do that whole extra stuff. Cause yeah, he might be coming off a little cocky. Maybe his response was too harsh. But on the day, that's his character. That's who he is. You know what I'm saying? If you don't like it, you don't like it. That ain't your cup of tea. But I don't know, man. Criticism and stuff like yeah. that, but. The way you was coming, you just ain't like you got it all like that. And I guarantee you probably got a roommate at home and it's just not giving anymore. Yeah. Well, let me say this, Queen. I'm a licensed plumber. So, I live, and I, I do real estate I live and property management. I live downtown. So what you I live downtown. I stay by myself, Queen. You know, and you're not even qualified to be even you dealing with me. You say everybody not qualified. To, you definitely not. 
You know, if anything, it was one of these two. I wasn't even looking your way. You and ain't the one my that type. you wanted popped up you, uh, That's fine. So that, what? That is, that's totally fine. Okay. But one thing about me, I could pull 100000 on the bank. Can you do the same? Get this yeah, you can't do that. Yeah, let's move on. Let's move on. You can't do that, though, Queen. All right. If we can have your name and age. Hi, I'm Esther. I'm 23. Okay. And Esther, uh, you still have your balloon unpopped. Why so? Are you done? Oh, yeah. I'm done with the rest of that. Okay. You know. Okay. Now we can talk, right? In a real way. Okay. What do you look for? I look What for are you looking for? A, a woman, like I said, that's not going to be promiscuous. A woman that's going to be consistent. A woman that has a career and things going for herself. Because I had the same thing going for myself. Okay. You know, as well. I don't need a woman to... Uh, Give me her money um, or anything. I'm just looking for devotion and some loyalty. That's all. And some honesty. Do you believe in God? Oh, certainly. Yes, ma'am. I'm a God-fearing man. I practice monotheism. You know, I won't tell you what I identify is religion-wise, but we can get to that at a later date and time, you we know, can. if you choose to uh, leave here with me. Okay. Do you know the Bible says that love is kind? Yes, certainly. Are you here for love or are you here to just insult I'm, I'm, I'm trying to create a family, you know, okay. that's what I aspire to do. Okay. Yes, ma'am. All right. You're good? Sure, we're good. Oh, okay. All right. Any questions for her? No, not at all. Oh. Do you have any kids? No, I don't. Do you want kids? I do. You How old gonna are you give again? Me huh? How old are you? I'm 29. How old are you? 23. Okay. Oh, she young. Is that okay? Yeah, that's perfectly fine. Okay. You know, okay. we might as well get up out of here right now. All right, well, let me, let me yeah. step out of here. Let's step away real quick for me. Step okay. that way. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I, I ain't going to lie. Them chicks are like, yo, girl, you supposed to be with us, man. You know what I'm saying? All right. So, seems like there's a little vibe here. So, is it going to be a yes for you for him? God says save souls. So, yeah. Oh, and is it a yes for you it's for her? It's going to be a hell yes for okay, me. Okay, we got him. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let me take this mic and y'all can go on off. <laughs> okay. I, I ain't going to lie to you, man. You know what I'm saying? Yep. <laughs> I understand why um, he was taking a lot of heat on social media. You feel me? After this show and all that. I understand why because people nowadays are too sensitive. Um, I think nowadays today's society is just too hard. It's so hard to be a real nigga. You feel me? Not even a real nigga, just to be a real person, honest person. You feel me? You can't really, when they say, oh, I speak my truth, you can't speak your truth, to be honest with you. Because when you speak your truth, somebody's always going to be offended. You feel me? So you're going to have to always sugarcoat, speak truth, allo lie to it. You get what I'm saying? For the person years, because if I'm generally 100% honest, somebody gonna be offended. So which meaning is you gotta be 100%, you gotta be honest, like maybe 30, and the rest gotta be some lies. I mean, that's how I'm seeing this as, because at this point, man, if you straight honest, you taking heat, and they call you arrogant, misogynist, and you know, oh, you being too cocky, at this point, man, you gonna have to lie, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, I'm not promoting anybody to lie. I, 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 I'm going to say right now. I'm not promoting, but I'm just saying that's how it's coming off as. But anyway, if you guys enjoyed this video, actually, take a few seconds. Subscribe, comment, like, and share. Click the notification bell. Join the family. Also, welcome to Shoe Your Sport. Guys, if you guys got any more videos y'all want me to react to, man, um, take a few seconds. Post it down in the comment section or just contact me on my YouTube, direct message me on you, um, direct message me on Instagram, you know what I'm saying? And follow me there and show me some support and love up there as well. All right, Musa out. <laughs>